Last time on American McGee's Alice, I wandered around this bizarre mirror maze with its uh, fairly confusing perspective on the world. And I got horribly, horribly lost. But I did find these jacks, which make an extremely effective weapon against the steam robots and uh, phantasmagoria as I keep finding in the maze. I don't really see any option other than to keep wandering forward. That looks different. Oh, damn it, it's this place again. Maybe I should try to reach that clock, I don't know. Ha <laughs> ha your clock is off. That was me. Don't get spun, whirled, twisted, gyrated, sloshed, or tossed. Avoid false moves. Huh. That was, uh... Okay, that was weird even for him. Wasn't any more helpful than it normally is, but uh it begs the question. How come that one's never come up before? What if I do it right now? The bigger they are, the harder they fall. And <laughs> now he's throwing cliches at me. Fantastic. All these broken mirror bits are uh, places where monsters came through. I don't really know why I'm bothering to explain that, as the only people watching this will have watched the one before this. Don't worry, folks. I don't plan to... Uh, make 15 videos of me just wandering around this place in a confused daze. At worst, if I can't figure anything out by the end of this video, I'm going to, uh... just check a fact or something. Strafing. Ah, oh, boy. I really should have checked a fact first, come to think of it. Like I said before, I can't actually alt-tab out of Alice while I'm filming. No, you know what? Let's do this. Okay, folks. This is definitely one of those things I would never have figured out on my own. I don't even remember if I had the internet in 2000. Memories of, uh... Anything more than about eight years ago all start to blend together. No, surely we did. Everyone had the internet in 2000. I'm only saying this because... Well... I would have only figured this out after HOURS of frustration. You see that clock? I was right, we do have to go to that clock. We have to go to that clock.
I'm gonna have to throw a knife into it. Uh, what number are the jacks? Six. Go figure, the hint was in the cutscene. Alright. Whoa, oh! That was weird. Let's go this way. That was unfortunate. What happens if I just walk off? Yeah, that's what I thought would happen. <laughs> All right. Just for the sake of argument. Oh well, that was easy. I guess I'm doomed. You guys don't try very hard. That's just a piece of clock. Ah! It's right over those creepy faces. Yikes. That was creepy. Carry on. <laughs> yes, good. Then I have to go over there and do the same thing, I guess. It's only a matter of time until one of these rooms is a trap. I'm fully aware of this. This is not fair. Come on. Sucks to be you, kid. You have to sleep in that bed.
Eat it. Ah. The Yume Nikki'd me. Damn it, damn it, damn it. What the hell? Kids are really annoying, you know that? supposed to be going? Abujum. Oh god. There's a giant number seven down there. Time, not a good time. Okay. Oh, he ain't coming back. Level sky is even more abstract than usual. <laughs> oh God! Ah! Oh. No! Oh God. <sighs> okay. Tune in next time when I try this room yet again. And uh, hopefully this time get through it in one piece. Laters.